Good day, this is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news and reviews. We have here the DT Watch X. Previously, we have a demo for the menus and features of the DT Watch X. We also have the specs and design. On this video, we are going to have a demo on how to pair it with the support app. The smartwatch DT Watch X is using the Wear Pro application. We have here the QR code. The application Wear Pro is available on Android and iOS. So we are going to have a step-by-step -step guide on how to connect the DT Watch X to your smartphone. So if you have any questions regarding the demo, just drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have the time. Alright, so let's begin and pair our DT Watch X. It's a beautiful looking smartwatch to the Wear Pro support app. So we have here our Android smartphone. So let's download the application first. Wear Pro. So we have here the app with over 5 million plus downloads. It's a popular application that is very lightweight, only 55 MB. On Android platform, it will automatically install once the download is finished. So let's wait for it to finish downloading first. Then it will automatically install it in our smartphone. So let's wait. Okay, it's now finished downloading. It has now finished downloading and it is installing in our smartphone. And as you can see here, it is it has successfully installed the Wear Pro app. Okay, so let's open the application. Let's see if there are some permissions. We have privacy policy. Agree? And we have here, you can log in with your old password or previous password and email. Or you can use third-party login here. In our case, we will use the guest mode. Tap on the guest mode. Login successful. So we have here our permission. Allow Wear Pro to access this device's location while using the app. Allow Wear Pro to find, connect to, and determine the relative position of nearby devices. Allow it. Okay. Are there additional permissions? Maybe later on for the smart notifications. Here on the bottom part, we have Help, Exercise, Discover, Device, and Me. To add your smartwatch, tap on Device. And as you can see here, we don't have any device connected to the support app so let's add our smartwatch okay so let's see unbind device first maybe there's some application that is connected okay then if this is the layout then you can add your own smartwatch search add Then wait for it to connect to the smartwatch. As you can see here, we have here a wearable. So let's see if that is our smartwatch. Go to settings. Check on the about section. And try to check the address here. So Bluetooth address 50C0F02C8144. You see it here? So this is our smartwatch. Tap on to connect. And it's now pairing. Bluetooth connection is successful. So we are connected. So just wait for it to complete. Paired successfully. So tap on finish. It is detected that the watch audio Bluetooth is not connected. Is it connected? Just tap on OK. Bluetooth pairing request. 
pair. Okay, and we are connected as you can see here, 85% for the battery life. Okay, so let's have allow access to contact. So this is the Bluetooth call. Just allow it. Allow to access messages. It automatically asking it automatically asks permission for the notifications. Allow. Then let's activate some of the features here. Incoming calls. Allow Air Pro to access your phone call logs. Allow Air Pro to access your contacts. Allow Air Pro to make and manage phone calls. Then SMS. So allow Air Pro to send and view SMS messages. Then at notifications. Okay. Notification access as you can see here. Just look for the Wear Pro app. Activate. Allow. Go back. Okay, let's wait. Then we have here app notifications. This is just an ad. Skip it. Okay, pick the desired applications. Viver, Strava, then TikTok. Let's see what else. Okay, seems like everything is okay here. We have the needed app application then go back okay so here as you can see you already enabled the app notifications sms notifications and incoming calls for your smartwatch let's see if there are some other settings here firmware the latest version heart rate monitoring let's activate it and that is 24-7 heart rate monitoring. Okay, seems like everything is okay. You do have the profile here, unit settings. Okay, we'll leave it as it is. Goal settings, you can set. We'll make it 10,000. Save. Go back. Permission settings. Here you can set, if you want to activate the camera control, you can set the permissions here. Okay, we do have, we already covered the basics here. And seems like everything is okay. So that's it. We are, we have successfully paired our smartwatch and set the necessary applications for our wearable. So if you have... Any questions regarding the pairing of the Wear Pro app on Android platform, specifically the DT Watch X, just drop a comment below and we'll try to answer your queries if we do have the time. Bye!